So here we are again with the portable GPS receiver project. It's on the breadboard now, and as you can see, all of the components are laid out. It's a little hard to look at it just here. I'm going to zoom in a little bit, and we'll see if we can explain something before we go outdoors. We have the voltage regulation circuit here, which being uh, consisting of the diode and a few capacitors on the input and output of the voltage reg regulator and what that does is it gives me a clean 5 volt signal received from the 9 volt battery up in the corner here. So from there we have a line down here which gives me my 5 volts and that's providing 5 volts uh, equally to the GPS receiver module, the LCD and nestled under the LCD the microcontroller being the pic 18 f 4550 so we have all the connections made and I won't go into it too much at this point because this has been kind of used and abused over the last few weeks what happened was the GPS was receiving coordinates it was broadcasting on the LCD but the problem was that it was only updating sometimes on the order of 10 to 15 seconds and sometimes two to three minutes in between updates which is completely unacceptable for a GPS module. So what we're doing is we've changed the code around using some nested if statements and these scrutinize the code one care uh, the the bits received from the GPS unit to the microcontroller one character at a time and if it does receive the uh, start of the GPGGA NMEA sentence it then proceeds to process the code as per the original programming code. So not a heck of a big change. The worst of it seemed to be lining up all of the parentheses for the if and while statements that I used. And from there, I have this thing updating now in real time. So as we can see, it's turned off right now. I'm going to turn the unit on. And there's the uh, last coordinates that it received. The light is flashing on the GPS receiver and it's waiting to get a fix on some satellites which we won't get because we're indoors I'm going to put my high-tech plastic baggie over the project and once we get the project going we're going to take it outside and we'll look at it updating in real time so I'm going to be doing this right now and from here I'll uh, turn off the video and we'll rejoin in a few moments